this basil from my garden, dried basil. Fresh is dying out, petering out. I could put a few fresh sprigs on top, but overall, my basil's hit a few cool nights and it doesn't look quite as healthy as it was a few weeks ago, or even a week ago. Fall is on its way. Fall is here, but the cool weather is on its way, I should say. This is just, um, I didn't have my mozzarella, my normal mozzarella, so I'm using mozzarella sticks. <laughs> you gotta use what you got, right? This will work. It's hard to do one-handed, and I don't want to set up my tripod for another pizza. I make pizza so much. Showing you how to make it because you know how to make it. I think there's enough everywhere to be able to be alright. Onions, peppers. I'm putting three different types, Joe. I'm putting. Well, I don't have a red pepper, but I have um tomato. So that'll be the red on the pizza. You want olives on the whole thing, Joe? You want black olives on the whole thing? That is better, but it's bright for my, my eyeballs. Do you want olives on the whole thing? Okay. Yeah. Okay. The whole thing. Okay, there we go. Last thing, olives. Parmesan cheese on top, a little oregano. Try to get these out. It won't work unless it's on the pizza. Cut, cut, cut. Olives on the, the entirety of the pizza. Okay, got it. The entire, entire. Entire thing. Yep. Olive. All of the pizza. Like a little bit of harm left. Just enough. And a little bit of. Can you open that? My hands are greasy. And I'm at 475, so that'll work. Thanks. Just a little bit on top. And that's it. You want to put it in for... Oh, no. You need the mitt. You want to put it in for me? Here. No. No, I'll do it. I got a straggler for a piece of cheese. 